you know, online behavior is very much a reflection of offline behavior. Uh, I think one of the things that we've seen, and especially with this election in particular, is that, you know, polarization just didn't happen because things just went online. You know, these are trends that have existed and are amplified in many ways, but that amplification isn't because of the, the tech itself is, is amplifying something that's ugly. I think it's ugliness that gets amplified as we keep moving because there are lots of spaces where folks are not getting to completion, the frustrations that they have in the now. And then as we move into the later, which I love Neelan's kind of approach on this, which is the now tends to be reactive. So you see a lot of sort of this content moderation that happens, right? Take down, make the message, you know, put some label on there, slap something on there, make it go away. But then there's nothing about in the long term, if I even go back as a historical record and look at the context, there's nothing for me to understand what happened. What was that decision? What was the longer term effect of how and why that happened? And, you know, I think it's a little easy to say that, you know, people will go and look at their bubbles. I mean, that, that, that happens, I think, but that's also just a reflection of people doing it in local spaces as well. 